Warren Buffett, Bill Gates, Elon Musk, Steve Jobs, Dan Pena, Ted Turner. Success leaves clues, kids. I just named five of the greatest names in business in the last 150 years. And they all have one thing in common. They're ball busters. Don't you understand? Don't you get it? You think Elon Musk wants to fit in? We know the answer is no, right? You want to fit in because you had poor role models at home. Most everybody in this room is a pleaser, but 98% of the high performance people are introverts. 98% of the high performance people on the planet, the uh, want to be liked, but being liked doesn't get you a raise. What kind of sacrifices are you willing to be super successful? 60 hours a week. Nobody is willing to work 60 hours a week to be successful. Nobody's willing to miss a wedding anniversary to be successful. Nobody is willing to miss a holiday. If you booked a holiday and something important happened in business, would you tell your family to go on the holiday without you and you're not gonna go? Nobody said yes, because you're not willing to make any sacrifices to be high performance. I still work 50, 60, I don't consider it work. I still work 50, 60 hours a week. And I haven't had to work in 35 years. Think of a product or a service that changes a billion lives i.e. Facebook, and you will, by definition, become extremely wealthy and you can go and take that money and the followers that you'll have to go uh, enhance the world in whatever manner you see fit. Our only benchmark is as long as it's legal, moral, and ethical. Anything goes. They've told you, the theory is, you set low goals so then you can uh, stair-step achievement and you won't be as disappointed when you fail. That's the theory. We have teenage multimillionaires flying around on their own jet planes. You should be embarrassed. Teenage multimillionaires flying around on their own jet planes. Growth only comes through pain. And no pain, no gain. It's the same in life. Elon Musk, Steve Jobs, Dan Pena, Ted Turner, amongst a whole bunch of other dogs, had one thing in common. We all slept in our office the first five or 10 years of our business life. Slept in our office the five, first five or 10 years of our business life. Most of you have been taught taking action is listening to a podcast. Taking action is reading a book. No, taking action is pulling the fucking trigger by saying four words what most people say in a book. Just do it. That's taking action. You can have anything you want in life as long as you work hard. The hardest worker in the room is always going to be the talented guy who doesn't work hard. In the end, maybe not every time, but in the end, hard work always wins. Talent doesn't guarantee you anything in this world. A good education doesn't guarantee you anything in this world. The world is riddled with smart people who have never achieved anything of significance. This world is full of talented individuals that never made it. The world is full of expensively educated kids that are outperformed by high school dropouts. Talent won't get you anywhere if you don't work for it. Talent won't get you anywhere if you have no heart. Talent is nothing if you have no guts. The one who is hungrier to reach the top will always get there before the talented guy. Maybe not immediately, but in the end, hungry always wins. In the end, hard work always wins. In the end, heart wins. Courage wins. In the end, the one who is more dedicated to reach the top will win. How can you beat the guy who will do whatever it takes? You can't. Hard work always beats talent when talent thinks he is too good to work hard. Talent can be a blessing, but it can also be a curse. It can make you think you don't need to work as hard as the other guy. And that is a mistake, my friend. Because the other guy is hungry. He is hunting your ass down, ready to fight. Fight for everything. Fight for his family. Fight for his legacy. Fight for everything. While you rest, I will work. While you rest, I will plan. While you rest, I will visualize. 
while you rest, I will believe. While you rest, I will strike. I will not stop. I will not rest. I will find a way. If there is no way, I will make my own path. Because your talent doesn't scare me, it drives me. Hard work never lies. My dream never dies. Most people give up in life because they come up with all sorts of excuses why they can't make it. They didn't get the right education. They aren't as talented as the other guy. They don't have the money. Listen, excuses are for the weak. It wouldn't take you long to find a massive success story who came from little education, no talent, but a relentless desire to succeed. This world is full of stories of greatness from nothing. It is never too late for you to start your own story. Every setback, every failure has formed part of your story. Don't let anything stop you from writing the rest of it. You are hungry. You will make it. Don't back down. Win at all costs.